Would you like an apple pie with that? Fat ass. Hello, YouTubers, and all those who happen to watch. Hope you guys are all doing good today. A little bit of the old man choir for the uh, holiday season to kick up a little bit there. Now, this is day three. As I pick up Schizophrenic right now. Today's game is going to be for the Sega Genesis. Now, it had some hunting goodness. It was great on both the Sega Genesis and the Super Nintendo. Both equally, to me, had a good port. However, the best version I came across, most affordable version, as well as the version that, you know, is in my hands today. Most nostalgic memories, of course. <laughs> anyway, is Zombies Ate My Neighbors. Now, Konami published this game. And all I gotta say for this is just two player greatness. I mean, you can play it first player, but two players you can play either as Zack or the other chick that the chick I can't remember her freaking name ever. So I'm just gonna call her that freaking chick that I can't remember. So, okay, so as you play, I usually play as a chick I can't remember her freaking name, uh, but I used to just play as her all the time because you know she had long hair. The guy. I had the uh, 3D glasses on, Zach there, uh, he was too damn corny for me to handle. The trick was just kind of more plain, so I was just like, fuck this, I'll pick her. So, I'd run up and down the map, find people, get up to Egypt. When I was a kid, I used to always get up to Egypt, and I used to just choke after that. So I'd get up to Egypt, choke. Alright, so, when I got older, obviously I completed the game, because I had more common sense and more coordination, and, you know, I was paying attention to the clock, and it was... It was one of those few games that you would actually enjoy thoroughly. Now, it was, I would consider it it's one of the finest uh, examples of a very good uh, zombie hunting game for the Sega Genesis. Now, there's many others that came out, like a few select, obvious, uh, humble bundle of them. But, true nostalgic memories, of course, obviously always come from Zombies Ate My Neighbors. Now, you could find this game on the cheap. It isn't too expensive, at least not anymore that I acknowledge, uh, but again, it was really affordable when I picked this up. I mean, this, I think I paid like 10 for it. It was cosmetically in good shape. No, has it sweet with a winky. And uh, <laughs> no manual, which I gotta go look for a manual online somewhere to complete the package. But yeah, uh, again, cannot highly recommend this game enough for all those uh, zombie hunting enthusiasts. Zombies Ate My Neighbors kicks off at number day three. Number day three, that is, makes no sense. Number day of 24. I put you down again, didn't I? I'm keeping this all in the video, by the way. I'm not going to edit stuff like this out. Yeah. <laughs> Whee! T number three! There we go. So that said, I'm gonna say thank you guys so much for watching and then stay tuned for day four, which will contain something somewhat retro, but yet not retro. Bye. Oh, my, my man, oh, my, my man, oh.